What is up everybody? Lynn Ray here. Um, I want to talk about something that's come up a few times over the last week. And it's come up, it was brought up by people who aren't even really that close to me. They are actual patients of mine. And like one of the patients I've, I've only known for about, you know, three or four days now. Uh, the other two I've known for about two weeks. But, uh, and it's, it's never really a simple answer, honestly. And so I don't really go into it with them. But these three people have asked me, why don't I have a girlfriend? <laughs> and, uh, and, and I actually have a, a good answer for that. I mean, I actually have a very, what I consider a legit answer for that. But, uh, but you know, it, it gets, it, it gets really deep and, you know, it's, and so I don't really want to spend time, you know, uh, spend time, um, describing or e examining that question and giving them details and stuff like that. But, but in a nutshell, I don't currently have a girlfriend because, <clears throat> because I'm working on myself right now. Um, one of the things I've learned over the years, you know, is you can't be happy in a relationship if you're not happy inside, right? If you aren't, if you aren't at peace in your heart, at peace in your mind, your soul, there is absolutely no way that you can be happy in a relationship, no matter how much you love that person and no matter how much that person loves you, there will always be something inside of you that uh, that's just full of angst and strife and anger and destruction and, and hate and jealousy and envy and all those those all those bad words so that's why I don't have a girlfriend right now I am 100% focused on me focused on focused on what I have to do in order to enrich my heart, my mind, my soul. And, you know, and, and when I get to that point, when I get to the point where I feel as though I have enough or I have what it takes to be in a legit relationship, a relationship that's, you know, that's long term, if I decide to do that, you know, I'll, I'll do it at that point, you know, but uh, right now, you know, I'm focused on me and uh, focus on building myself up. You know, um, one of the things I've learned is, is you attract what you are. You know, if you are a, if you have some things going on inside, some demons inside of you, some, um, you know, those, those things that I, that I mentioned earlier, the envy, the jealousy, the hatred, the, the spite, you know, all of those things, if you have those inside of you, guess what you're going to attract? You're going to attract someone who has all of those qualities or who has most of those qualities. And, um, and I know that to be true. So uh, that's, you know, and that's why, you know, at this point in my life, I'm not really focused on, on finding the one, you know, or finding uh, anyone at that point. You know, if someone happens to come in, you know, I'll, I may examine and see how it goes from there. But uh, I'm not in the process of looking for anything uh, just because I need to focus on myself. You know, it has nothing to do with, you know, being better than anyone or, or whatever. It's all about being better, period, right? Being a better person, you know, physically, mentally, spiritually, emotionally, all of those things, right? And, and once you're, and I feel once you're at that point, you know, you will attract someone who is of the same vibration. And uh, that's why, so... Anyways, I'm going to head inside, get showered up, and uh, I will talk to you guys later. Peace.